And she got a static on Krill on the war node on Mars. This is a bit of a rerun because for some reason I seem to have lost my original recording. But just so you guys can see, we're running something pretty basic here. We've just got some health and some redirection on and rush so we can move a bit faster. As for the weapon, we're using the bolter for this. Everybody should have access to this. I've just upgraded serration and we've got speed trigger on. It's important to have an automatic weapon for this just because that's how we need to get through this boss fight. Either way, with that explained then, we are going to be... Coming on over to Mars, where we can go into war. I'm just going to do an invasion here. I'll explain this a little bit later on. I kind of purposely not said anything because they're level 20. But into the assassination we go. The here. journey Find there them. should be pretty simple. Out. So I don't need to detail that. We're just going to follow the waypoint as we make our way to the boss. Great, so once you get close, you'll have, he always spawns on this platform. You'll have a cinematic play, so um, watch that if you really want to. I not about that right now, but you can't. So basically the way this is going to work is, you see he's sending ice out at us. We need to target the pipes on its back to start with. That's what we need. We need the pipes on its back. Come on. Come on. None of that's counting, apparently. Come here. There we go. We've got one loose. Now we want to, get, we want to get in close, and we want to try and bait the big overhead slam. That's going to make him freeze. Now we've caught our first bit of damage. We've got to rinse and repeat that a little bit. Let's get you down. Get out of the way. So we do that again. So we've got to oop, target the backpack until... I'm gonna go down here. Excuse me. Get up. You've got too many friends helping him. Frozen again there, we did get it. That's good. Didn't get much of the way damage out of that, that's a shame. I shouldn't have set any alarms off on the way in here really. There we go, frozen again. Get some more damage on the backpack. Nearly there. Once he's lost both of his pipes, you'll see that they break off as you uh, make them loosen. I get hit by a status now, I'm stuffed. That's perfect, because we're sending the beam again. There we go. Right, now we need the melee attack, please. Come on. Get off. Get cool, down. Damage. Okay, so, once he's lost his pipes, he's gonna go all fiery. Just make sure you give him some space, because he can blow up, I think. Once that's done, we can now just damage him normally. Just the bolts are pretty good with the speed. It's quite nice. Oh, run out of bullets. Uh, no shields, that's no good for me. Could go in there do some melee. Probably easier. There we go. Well, so once it's down, extract as usual. That'll be the end of the mission. And as we'll see, he drops the Excalibur parts. So, if you guys want to build Excalibur, you can grab, gather all the little parts now. And very soon, once we get over to Phobos, you'll be able to start getting the pastas that you need to start getting this built. So, either way, that's going to be the end of the video. I hope it helps you beat Let Krill, and I'll uh, see you all again soon.